good. It must be an easy ride. Man, he's getting carried right now. He's getting carried. Must be nice getting carried. I wish I could get carried. That, that'd be awesome. TV's coming in on Almighty. He's going to get hit by one. Those are devastating to tankers. Extremely devastating to tankers. It can really ruin your day. But being that far out of the map, you're not going to really have to worry about too much. Unless that chopper comes in after you. Almighty, see, he's already got his reps back up. He's fine. He's good to go. Sticking on with Rhino right there. Ooh, Havoc almost with the TV on Medi. Looks like it's a dust. And there goes the dodge. Another solid... Solid dodge by DMI. Cobra Skyfire really working his butt, trying to make sure he doesn't get hit by any of those TVs. Well, they're going to focus more on the tanks now, probably. Seaback Killer has a couple guys in front getting taken RPGs from the right. No, it's a Shraw, excuse me, up from up on top. I don't know if he's going to be able to contest here. He's down to 50% health. He's going to have to back out. He's not going to be able to see. You better watch out for those IEDs. Those IEDs can prove fatal. You hit those at the wrong time or at the wrong angle, you will be toast. 50% health. He's just going to go ahead and contest this right here. Run an LMG. Go ahead and take out a setup. AP, LMG, an auto loader. I personally like auto loader a lot. Thermal optics. I'm more of a zoom optics guy, but whatever floats your boat. If he can make it work, he makes it work. He's going to go ahead and wear another one. 50% health. Still contesting. One end is pushing up for five objectives here. They're almost on a full cap. DMI is going to have to really PTFO and really start holding down some objectives. They're going to go ahead and take E. The general is going to try with a spawn beacon. He's going to rat it out. Spawn beacons are allowed. For anybody who is wondering, spawn beacons are allowed. Just commit suicide. He's going to spawn back in. I don't know. He might have committed suicide too early. Meanwhile, like Seabach. Seabach killer is taking a lot of fire. He's 34% health. He's going to go ahead and take one right in the tracks. He went broadside and Rhino's going to take him out. General getting back in a tank. He's going to try and help out. See if Beer can do something. He's going to get taken out by a tank. Father's going to get picked by Demon. The AD kid's really trying their best here. The ground infantry team for DMI AD. Really trying their best to hold on to A and B up here. It looks like they're. this is a losing battle because one end is focusing everything they have on this objective because it is the last objective for DMI. Meanwhile, we have Heat Seekers coming in from Linder, going in on Fluffy. I don't know if he's going to be able to countermeasure. He doesn't. He's going to get mobility hit. Let's see what happens here. See if he can somehow... Nope. Linder's going to go ahead and take him out. That's going to be it for Fluffy. He's going to go back to the jet screen. Probably help out on infantry right now. Looks like DMI is going to have air superiority here in a second. I don't know if Medi's going to be able to pull out of this one. He's going back to the static AA. Going to go ahead and play a little bit of defense. Meanwhile, Linder's just going to go ahead and vertical continue to contest here players going out tv missile from havoc on to one in one inch chopper medi and chupa but that's a tough tough dodge to do especially when you have a jet coming down on top of you extremely hard meanwhile we have a point blank tank set up going here looks like general's just going to go ahead and take this one. Oh no hold on a second he doesn't know the guy jumped out i don't know if he knows he jumped out he doesn't know missed rpg by almighty oh it's going to be too late he's going to get run over Squishy Squashy did. He missed missed his chance. It could have proved fatal for General if he would have been able to get that off. Dark Raid is going to contest E right here. He's going to get picked, though, and go down. Demon's going to go ahead and hold on to that. But your real father went ahead and picked him up. He's got two on him. They're down low, though. He does have height advantage. Small's going out. It's a hit marker. Doesn't get the kill. He's got a man spawning on him. Small almost picks him on the corner. Great heads up play right there by your real father. Anticipate that movement. Smalls and Straws going down. We got a little bit more action coming down here at A. Looks like 1N is going to be taking this flag. There's a heavy presence here, although General is contesting with a tank. He's got infantry support. Vector picks up a two piece on Reckham and Seabax. DMI is still again pushing in right now. Heisenberg goes down. Still alive. Jackpot finally goes down. The contest is no longer there. DMI is going to go ahead and maintain, maintain control of A. Now they have control of both the top two objectives. Pulling in, pulling right back into the game. Only down by 160 tickets. So he has contest in front. Points is going to miss his shots. See if he gets a little bit of help. He gets one. Heisenberg gets the other. Trade's going down in schoolhouse. Two piece by points. Montes, I, I'm not sure how to say it going to say Pontes or points. Uh, I think points would be... Uh, nah, that wouldn't be good. I got to do, do Ponts. Pontes, Pontes, Ponts. 
pawns. Pawn? Just do pawn. You can just do pawn. I mean, there, that, that works. Doing well for his infantry team right there. Although B is being contested. TV's coming in onto General. I think it missed. He's taking RPGs. General's taking RPGs. He has a lot of infantry support up on Bravo right now. However, the contest is real. I don't know. You can't shoot through that. I think that's an invisible texture. Igla's Cobra Skyfire ratting out in the bushes here. He's got Igla's out. He's going to go ahead and lose the lock on that one. All right, he's going to go ahead and pursue. More Igla's on Reckham. Reckham's got Igla's, but he's going to contest C here. DMI pushing in for a five cap. They might get it. If they get there, they can pull in. If they hold it for about a minute, they will be able to pull within a reasonable amount of tickets possibly come back in this game. As if anybody doesn't know, these matches are decided by ticket difference. It's not that you win a match win a map one round you gotta get gotta get tickets so even if one end was to win by a hundred tickets it would still EMI would have to come back beat them by a hundred or more to win the map those of you who aren't familiar with that creature's gonna go ahead and take down Wreckham on the contest and they're gonna hold on to C one end's pushing up looks like they're gonna go ahead and try and take A Garbage Jr. moving up in a tank the flank on a jeep I don't know if Galvatron you gonna shoot the Jeep? I don't know if you saw the Jeep or is he just letting him run away? It's too late now. It's too late now. He just missed his chance right there. It looked like that was gonna be an easy kill. Dark right has people spawning on him. They're gonna go ahead and try and take Delta back here. They don't want that train going pat going across the other side of the map. It proves a real difficult objective to get back, especially when it's all the way in the other team's base. It's a slow moving train, and when you have it on your side, Give yourself an advantage. It's basically like a free objective because it's right in your spawn. He's going to go ahead and drive to E. Contest. Get in the Artie truck. See if he can put some damage onto the DMI tanks. Gar I guess Garbage Jr. in the tank. I don't know if he's going to be able to... Might be taking some damage from that. M16A4. Tank is still alive. Arkwright's still going for it. Heavy presence on Delta. Although Garbage Jr. is up here by himself. But there's three 1N, four 1N players. I think he's getting repair tooled right now. Try and jump in with it. Seabax Killer's back up here. They have three tanks. It looks like they have one of one end tanks. If I'm not mistaken, they have taken one of one end's tanks. Because there is not three tanks on this map. That's that's a crucial loss. Crucial loss. I don't know if he's going to see these. Ooh. Thermal right there. Sees it. No problem. He's going to go ahead and lock that down. They're going to try and take D. I don't see why not. they got three tanks on one right now. Oh, but there goes Garbage Jr. He's going to go down. Straw's coming in for Seabax, but he's going to go ahead and block with AP. General's up on his right-hand side here helping him. He's got man behind. Oh, but a small in the back's going to take down General. They only got one tank left. So it looks like that three-tank lead that they had is not going to prove any problem for one in as they take down both of the tanks. Look at that. Piece of rubble is proving difficult for your real father, but he's going to take down Linder with the G18 in the end. Fight is real. They have people contesting. DMI is contesting here. Trades are going to go down. Hogman gets picked. Fector gets picked. Real father's up top. He's the last one alive. He's got one on him, but he's going to get picked as well. That's going to go down, and it looks like DMI is going to go ahead and take that objective. There are DMI is only down by 20 tickets. 20, 30 tickets. They're right back in this is what they needed to do. They got themselves, they were down almost by 150 plus tickets. They're get right back in it. They just need to make sure they hold on to three plus objectives and they're going to do that right now. They have A, B, and C. They have all three. One end's going to have to contest something. They have multiples here. Scruffy's on the flank. I don't know if, I don't think DMI knows he's here. He's going to get one. Ponce is going to go down. The guy in the rubble, Ponce is going to get him. No, Scruffy's going to go down. Dogman's going to go ahead and clean that up and defend Charlie perfectly. Great plays on him. Myriad's out here in the middle of the open. Oh, it's a tough situation he's got on him right now. He's got guys coming in. He's going to play Rat. He's going to anchor it for his team. Hopefully they're going to get this contest. Looks like DMI's also going for E right now. Only 13, 10 tickets now. Only 10 tickets. Garbage Jr. is sitting here. He's going to contest E. He's got a man in front. But he's going to go down. Fector's going to clean that up. They're going to go ahead and take maintain control of Echo. Dogman goes down up on C. One end's contest is real. Meanwhile, Fluffy... Flying up in the atmosphere, checking out. Uh-oh. He's going to ECM Snake. I don't know if uh, Linder sees it coming. He doesn't see it coming. This could be bad for Linder. He's going to have to make a, make a move here. This could be tough. Going in for a switch. The dogfight. Here it goes. Oh, he gets him on the cut. 
That is veteran jet piloting right there, ladies and gentlemen. That That is an extremely hard cut to guess, let alone to hit. It takes a lot of jet flying, a lot of jet flying experience, a lot of time in the air for Fluffy Marshmallows. Extraordinary jet pilots. It's unfortunate for Linder. He got picked right off the spawn. One end's pulling the lead, though. They're still holding it by 20 tickets. Heat Seeker's coming in. Supertron looking for a TV. He gets it. Is he going to land it? He might land it here. He does. Solid TV missile by, Co by Two Patron on Cobra. Take him out of the game right there. You're going to have air superiority. The tanks are going to have to watch out. General's going to be under a lot of fire right now. He's going to be under a lot of fire, but they are going to take E. They do have a three-cap lead right now. They might be able to pull within. Maybe if they can hold it. They got a huge presence on E. I don't know if 1N knows this, but... Dark Wright still contesting, gets a pick. Linder's gonna go down. Dark Wright's still here, causing problems. They're gonna leave the objective and they're gonna go ahead and start burning it out. This is gonna be proof tough for DMI if they don't hold this. Rhino's up contesting Bravo right now. He's got AP out. I don't know what kind of camera angle this is, but we're just gonna go ahead and zoom out. They're contesting Bravo. They're gonna probably get it about 50% capped right now. He has a man to his left. He knows he's there. He's looking for him, sees him, gets hit. He's at 82% health, plenty of health left. Got two guys spawning in for DMI to contest this right here. Rhino's having problems with these potholes. They can prove so difficult, these drifting simulator tanks that we have in Battlefield. He's taking a lot of NG fire. He's getting NG bombed right now. 38 health left. Might have to jump out here and rep. He's going to do just that. He's going to back out. He's taking a lot of fire. Linder's back up in the jet. Havoc Slayer on A. Trying to contest, make sure that... One in does not keep it. It's coming right down to the wire here. Two two objectives to two. Only down by 11, no, nine tickets. I can't add. I went to potato, potato school. I can't, I can't count, so it's all right. Some of us have to sacrifice. Let's see who we got. Seabax contesting A. They're gonna, looks like DMI is gonna hold this down. I don't think one in's presence is gonna be enough on this objective. I think it's going to be up. They have a motion sensor down. They got multiples here. They, this is this is the cap that they need. This is the fight. This is where it's going to be for the rest of the game. This is for the win right here. Seaback's going to get a two-piece. Myriad and your real father are going down. Rhino's going to have to get in there and do something, but they're going to lose. They're going to lose that cap, and they're losing Delta. Rhino's going to have to contest here. He's got real father spawning on it, but he has a lot of guys in front, and there's an attack helicopter on. It's like somebody's soloing it. Gonna get one pick, your real father, Demon's gonna go down. He's got two to his left. He sees him, he's gonna get shot in the back, but doesn't get anything off of it. Two guys to him. Got infantry spawning in, he has infantry help. That rock's gonna prove a little bit difficult, but he's gonna dodge a lot of these RPGs. He's gonna take another one, 58 health. He's gonna have to get some shots off. He's taking another one, 17 health. He's getting Angie bombed right now, needs a little bit of help. Galvatron's gonna go ahead and swoop in there. Linder is on top. Round is complete. DMI takes it. 12 tickets to none. What a comeback. Did not see that happening, but they did everything they needed to to get back in the game. Well played by DMI. Extremely well played. It's unfortunate that 1N came down to that last objective on A and did, just could not clutch it. They just could not clutch it. It's a tough one. You know, the DMI had a huge presence on A. That was where that was the game right there. It might have even been better maybe just to slack back or go back to B and maybe try to cap that and just leave everybody there, maybe get picks, but I'm not playing. I'm just going to go ahead and trust these guys. They know what they're doing. It was a really close game. Extremely amazing gameplay from both teams. Trades are going down. Great pushes. I mean, one in came out extremely strong. Got a 150 ticket, almost 200 ticket lead, but DMI did not give up. They were down to 99 tickets, and when one end still had 200, and they were able to pull in cap three to four objectives they maintained a four objective cap for for about a minute and pulled them right back in within 30 tickets and then from there it was just trading objectives the rest of the game absolutely amazing game right there it was one of the best games i've seen so far we're still gonna go on ahead in to the next round of gold mud i might throw in another poll here pretty soon so be ready be ready Gonna get you guys interacted. And if you guys want to see your tweet on stream, make sure you guys are tweeting at Tanner J. Larson. Um, I tweet at me. I'll put your tweet on stream. 
just goes up real quick just like that nice and easy if you want that on there you guys have questions you have comments anything go ahead and throw it at me at Tanner J Larson um, now I can throw it up there for you throw it up there for you so we're gonna wait here while we get into this looks like everybody's gonna be spawning in sometime soon possibly maybe you're gonna be waiting we have 12 on 12 somebody disconnected Bonfin's in here making a change looks like there's substitution going in for one end gonna take in Bonfin I don't know who subbed out I'm trying to look at it looks like Almighty subbed out and he might have lagged out Bonfin was sitting by standing by right now looks like we're ready to go okay so one end's gonna have to win this map to win this map, they're going to have to win by more than 12 tickets. More than 12 tickets. It's going to be a tough one. I mean, you, it seems easy at first, but I mean, with DMI's comeback like that, they're putting up a huge fight. Somebody, they're definitely a group not to be messed with. You got to got to really lock down your objectives and hold down the majority of them and get a huge lead. Even bigger than 150, apparently. It was looking grim for a moment at the beginning of the game for DMI, but they sacrificed everything just for C. It's a good central location. Easy, easy access to Alpha and Bravo, even Delta. At one point, DMI did have three tanks. Now that might have proved fatal for one end. That might have tipped the scale right there when they had the three tanks for. I think they had a tank for one of their tanks for a good two or three minutes. The countdown is coming. It's the final countdown right now. We're going to come down to the last map, last round. Sorry, last round of this map. Excuse me. DMI is leading by one game to zero. I'm gonna go ahead and take a look. Hop in here. We got two Jeeps going out. The race for Delta is real. See where they go. Got one Jeep going to Delta. One's going up to A and B. TVs are coming out. It looks like there was a dust or somebody jumped out of a TV missile. Avix players are going out. He's gonna go ahead and retreat back to his base. Hopefully he's gonna have his jet come in here. Linder's ECM and gonna try and drop off some heat seekers. He does. He gets two heat seekers off onto Cobra. Cobra's gonna go ahead and wear those though. It's not gonna be a big problem. I think. Yep. Linder's just gonna go ahead and chase Fluffy away. Rocket Pod's going out. Galvatron's up here. Bravo and Alpha looks like one ends off to an early start again, getting Alpha and Bravo objectives. They have three objectives again. Three out of five. Again, we see DMI going for Charlie objective. They get it, and here they go. They're going to go ahead and try and contest Delta right here. He's going to throw a nade. Reckham's just going to throw a nade. Oh, is that an enemy? Is that a friendly? I was wondering if they were going to shoot him, or maybe it was just my eyes, but it looks like DMI is going to try and contest this, but I don't know if they're going to be able to get it before it gets to the other side of the map. There is somebody on the objective. Garbage Jr. is moving in. He's going to try and get Eagles out, but he's going to get picked. Dark Knight's right there. He's going to get a two-piece. Great defense by Dark Knight. He's going to go ahead and hold Delta for his team. That's going to that's a huge objective to have early in the game. It really helps get the early ticket count down for the other team. TV's coming in on Seabax. They're going to have to double rep this. Maybe just one. Here comes a chopper. AP's going out. General's on the repairs, but I think the chopper's not going to be able to kill him. He's just doing a little bit of damage, letting him know, hey, getting a little bit too far on this side of the map, bud. You need to chill out, okay? You need to just step down just a little bit. Just, just chill out. Got a tank in front here for Rhino. I don't know if he sees him. Try and hop back in with him. We get there, we get there. Bonfin. Bonfin's up here in the tank. He's got a tank in front as well. They're gonna go two on one right here. They're gonna get shots out. I don't think he knows that he's gonna get double teamed. There it goes. The NG bomb. Seabax killer is gonna go down in one end. He's gonna go ahead and contest C, and they're gonna probably take this. I don't know if they see all the mines though. I don't know if they're going to see all these mines. It could, if somebody moves up too fast, they're going to get hit by all these slams. Got a guy to his left. Bonfin's got a guy to his left. He's going to see him. It's a shot out on him. Nothing happens. Garbage Jr. is going to contest C. Here we go. We're going to hop in with Wreckham real quick. Haven't seen much gameplay from him last, last map, but he just gets picked right there on the objective contesting A. That's too bad. Mines are going down behind him. Garbage Jr. is throwing mines. He's going to throw a grenade out. On Bonfin, 
Is he gonna get the kill with the grenade? He gets a frag kill on Bonfin in the tank. Bonfin just getting stuck in the rubble right there. It's a terrible spot to get stuck. That's unfortunate. Didn't really have any help. He's just getting picked right out in the open. Incredible play by Garbage Jr. Throwing a little bit of fun into the mix. Meanwhile, Dark Wright doing what he does. He's gonna sit on this building and just like we saw last game, he's gonna contest F. Sorry, E, excuse me, E, I'm getting all my objectives mixed up. I can't even, I don't even know, what are those letters up there? Something? I figured it was F. I mean, normally it's F, Conquest Large. Just thinking Conquest Large, excuse me for my fault. It looks like, you know, he's got a lot on his hands out here. Beautiful scenery, weather's nice, sun's out. Oh look, free missile truck. And Linder's gonna go in after Fluffy. Fluffy's gonna go back to his base real quick. It's gonna be a tough pick. Well, nope, he's just gonna go ahead and go back, but now he's gonna have Fluffy on his on his tail or not. No, he doesn't, because they have air superiority. It looks like DMI's chopper team is keeping one end at bay with that. Could be another reason why one end lost a hold on that last game. They just they just seemed like their chopper just wasn't there for a little bit. I mean, it gotten TV'd a couple times. We didn't really see too much of it. I'm just assuming. It may have been different. Just a commentator. Havoc is going to contest A with his group. He's got a couple guys here from one end. They also have tank support. Heisenberg's going to go ahead and get a double peep. He's going to get a two-piece on Scruffy and Galvatron. I don't think yeah, one end's not going to be able to take A, but they do have C, D, and E, and that's still going to keep that burn up. They are up ahead by 40 tickets, which is more than enough to win at this point um, if it comes down to it. Remember, they do have to win by more than 12 tickets to take this map. General's gonna move into C here. Got friendly and enemy mines. Vision 1 rock crawler. It's tough to do that in a, in a tank. He's doing an extremely good job of it. He's got a Jeep coming in. I don't know if he sees him. He's gonna get a shot off. He gets a mobility hit, but the Jeep's gonna go ahead and bail out. Two tanks are going in here. Taking in shots from RPGs. I thought that might have been the chopper. It sounded like it. General's down to 48% health. Gonna have to get a pick here. Nope. Wood Fence is going to block his shot. The real father is putting up a little bit of fight. He has three squad mates here with him. All of them, probably engineers, are going to have to contest this and hold it. Vector Z also with Smaz. I don't know if they know those mines are there, but they could use them to their advantage. General is taking a lot of fire right now. Probably down to less than 30 health. Easy. But meanwhile, with the distraction on C, DMI is sweeping the top side. Taking A. And they're going to take B here easily. Oh, maybe not. No, one end is contesting. Jackpot gets a pick on Pont. Got a guy coming around the corner. Nope. He knows he's there. Heisenberg's just going to go ahead and use the hip fire. Knows there's one more ahead. If he's going to get the pick here, he does. He gets a two-piece. Easy right there. Gonna continue to contest, but they are... No, they are gaining it. I believe that was the last person. If I'm not mistaken, that was the last person. Maybe it wasn't. Nope. Still one more one end player. On the objective, on Bravo, he's getting picked. Your real father with his AK-5C making it work, but the callouts are going down. Smalls are going to go up. He's going to get picked by a small. Great callout by DMI. Heisenberg picking it up. Oh, my VDV buggy. It's hit by a mine or a... No, he got hit by the tank and shot him straight into a DMI player to get run over. But DMI is going to go ahead and maintain easy control of the top two objectives. There's only three guys up here for one end. Let's see if we can jump in with somebody. Going with Heisenberg here. He's got a man in front. He's going to go ahead and get that pick. He has lots of help behind him. He didn't get that pick. Seaback stole it from him. They're going to maintain control of both those objectives. DMI again pulling back into the game. Maintaining objectives. Getting getting that three, three objective majority. He's going to pull them real close in. Probably within, I would say, 15 tickets, 10 tickets if one end doesn't make a play. But they're getting picked really, really quick right here. He's got a man in front. Heisenberg sees him. Run an SG553 with a suppressor. One of my, I really like that weapon. It's a very solid weapon. Extremely stable. Extremely accurate. It's pretty decent. Up to mid range. He's got a recon. Is he a recon with Iglis? He must have picked up a different kit. Had to have been the case. He's got mines and everything. DMI's just putting up a huge fight. Huge fight on A and B. Huge presence. One end's losing C. They only have Delta in their favor. That's it. But I believe they're going to make a push here. Five guys on Harley right here. I don't think you're going to get... I don't know if Jackpot's going to get this Jeep out in time. He doesn't have the four-wheel drive function. It's only front-wheel drive. you got to get that Honda out of there, man. He's going to go up and flank to a different objective. 
possibly go to Bravo because there is a huge presence from DMI pushing to see. There is a, however, Scruffy is up here with a tank. One end's tank is getting NG bombed. Seabax, I believe, no, it's General in a bad spot right here. Oh, but he's going to go ahead and back out and get away. Bonfin's not going to be, oh, there wasn't Bonfin, excuse me, whatever, one in tanker was not able to get the pick right there, General was looking like he was going to be in trouble, Galvatron up here at sea, maintaining presence, they have one person in front, he's going to go ahead and go back, taking fire, wreck him with Iglas out on the chopper, they don't even know he's there, this is going to be, this is going to go bad for Meticulous, this is really bad, he's got Iglas everywhere, he's going to get hit, no, he's going to get picked, Bonfin's coming back to Delta to help, he's got to take out all the Iglas squad, He's pulling out a serious clutch right here to keep that chopper alive. They're really going to need it in the late game. DMI pulls a 20 ticket lead while they cap four objectives on one end. Four guys in front, three guys in front for Bonfin. Dogman trying to be a medic, trying to stay alive so you can revive people. Arbus Jr. with RPGs gets a hit. Hit out on Bonfin. Bonfin's mobility right now. Got another one on him. He's down to 50% health. Arbus Jr. still alive. He's the last one. No! Bonfin's going to go ahead and take that out. He's going to probably go ahead and take... Get Delta back for his team. Great play by Bonfin to get in there and help out his team. Help out that chopper to keep it alive. I think that chopper's alive. I could be eating my words on that one. But DMI, again, making a huge presence on the top two objectives. Really play for C. And then coming back up to the top. They got six, six, seven people up here on A and B. Looks like that's going to be on lockdown. They're maintaining control up here. I don't see one in taking that back. They got a squad of three pushing here. Motion sensors on Bravo for DMI. Let's see if they can hold it. All outs are going to go down. Jackpot's going to get the one behind him. They still got a full squad here. Squad's working together. One in schoolhouse in front. That one's going to get picked by Galvatron. Scruffy moving in for the cap. Got the motion sensor, Myriad, with a great play. Shra's coming in on the infantry right here, wasting away the cover. Let's see if Scruffy can get a pick. Myriad's taking a lot of fire. He's been spotted. There's only one guy on the objective contesting. He knows where he is. He's got another one in front. Don't know what's going to happen there, but Cobra Skyfire, the DMI's chopper is back up with a presence. One end's going to cap E. They're contesting Delta. He's probably going to get that back. Myriad Creature's going to get picked. He's going down by Pawn. Pawn with a two-piece, but then Scruffy's going to go ahead and clean that up. See if he's going to... No, we can't get Heisenberg. Heisenberg's going to maintain objective control right there. Jackpot, again, he's also getting picked on Bravo. One end's going to lose that. Small going to go out. Creature's going to try for a small. Hopefully he's going to put that on his montage, but it didn't work out that way. Didn't get the hit. He's got men in front. Got a man behind. Let's see what Creatures can do. He's going to try and turn on him. He's got the SG. He's got guys up in front of him. He's not going to... He's going to get double teamed. Wreck him with the clean up there. Galvatron, however, here with the squad. I don't think DMI is going to be able to hold this. Going to get a couple picks. Galvatron with one. Jackpot with another. They're going to go ahead and maintain control. They're going to contest this. They're going to need it. They're down by over 70 tickets here. Looking pretty grim. They're going to need another objective. DMI, meanwhile, hook Delta from one end on their side of the map. It's going to go ahead and start going over towards DMI side. Losing time here. Somebody's got to get on that objective. But one end's going to maintain control of C. They have a tank pushing. Fluffy Marshmallows with Igla. He's going to go ahead and try and push up on this chopper, maybe. No, he's going to commit suicide. TV going out. Chupatron just misses. Chopper battle is about to start. Heat Seekers coming in. Flares going out. Not going to hit. TV. Oh, no. The TV glitched. Their chopper's going down, but they do have fire extinguisher. It's going to stay alive gonna stay alive that could have been bad that could have been really bad well they have straws coming in chupatron saving that one great setup on the gunner with the extinguisher that saved them right there but i don't know if it's going to be enough dmi is pulling in with a hundred ticket lead here late in the game they're going to cap echo as well and now they're going to cap c one end's getting wiped on all objectives right now they only have one man left that was creatures and he's not ratting anymore he's back to the spawn screen dmi is pulling a huge huge advantage right now three objectives four objectives to one and they're losing this one tank with Wreckham out there bonfin's in some trouble maybe the chopper can help him out hopefully the chopper can get in there maybe not Arvis Jr. is pulling up also to help bonfin's going to go down dmi is going to main try and cap this objective and get rid of it so one in doesn't have it i think that chopper's having a hard time right now Meanwhile, Dark Knight still on Echo. As Straw's going out, trying to swing one over there. He gets a hit marker. He knows he's there. 
See if he can get a pick right before the end of the game. He's going to get him. Yep, he's going to go down. Fector Z is going to go ahead and take that one. Havoc's going to go down. Linder coming in. Try and take out Fluffy Marshmallows. He does on a strafe on the chopper. I believe the chopper is going to survive. DMI's chopper does survive. And I believe DMI is going to take this one. DMI looking extremely strong here in the early maps. Great objective control. Great map control. Great res team response to each objective that's being taken. Um, they're going to go ahead and take that 138 to 0. Amazing gameplay. So that, that was another early start by one end, getting majority of the objectives capped. Holding a lot of, uh, taking a lot of tickets off early, but DMI again holding on in the late game. Their late game is extremely strong. One end's got an extremely strong start. It's two, two completely different play styles, it seems like. Trying to get that early. One end's trying to get that early cap, get that early burn, and then just maintain throughout the rest of the game. And DMI is just kind of like giving it to them, just taking C, and then spreading out from there. It's it's kind of like a different effect. Looks like we're going to be switching some players here, I imagine. So without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and throw up the slideshow. I'm going to put some music back on. And, uh, whoa some music back on. I'm going to throw up a couple polls. Solid games from both teams. Great games right there. Uh, we got another poll coming in. I'm going to throw it up here for you guys. Who do you guys think is going to win? Zavid. That is the question. Get your votes ready. I'm going to post the link in chat. And then we can get right on into it. Also got some tweets coming in from people. I got cupcakes for everyone, apparently. Somebody said they got cupcakes. Nicholas. I believe that would be Elka. Here's the poll, guys. Straw, pull it out. New poll is available. Get to voting, guys. Get to voting. Get to voting. Who is going to win Zab at One Nation? Or DMI. DMI coming in with an early lead here. Guys, go ahead and throw it down. Remember, if you guys need to, you want to tweet, you got a question, comment, make sure you tweet at me, at Tanner J. Larson. And I will throw your tweet up on stream. Talk about it. Whatever you want to throw up there. Trees will win this match. Maybe. Maybe. When is Netflix and chill? Not during this. Just click that link, Master Chief ND, straw poll 5480987. For those of you guys who don't know, you guys want to see some more gameplay from each of these groups, I'll throw their Twitch TVs up there. I'll throw their Twitches so you guys can check them out. Make sure you guys go hang out, give them a follow. One in Twitch. One in Twitch. I'm going to throw up Deadman Esports as well. DMI underscore Twitch. DMI Twitch. There it is. There it is, guys. There it is, guys. Have a tribute for Bonehead Warrior at halftime. No negative Ghost Rider. It's not going to happen. No, it is not. Those are their Twitches, guys. You want to hit them up on Twitter? It's at One Nation Clan. Make sure you follow them on there. You also have at I believe it's Dead Man Esports. Dead Man Esports. There you go, guys. Looks like they're going to still One Nation with the favor. One Nation has a heavy favor in chat. It's like people want One Nation to win. Still believe. The belief is real. Are we going to go to a third map? Is Rogue going to be needed? Attack jets and tanks? Maybe. It might be possible. We'll just have to wait and see. Team DMI. Am I taking the first match indeed, Giacco? If you guys go ahead and check out those social medias for those two teams, putting up a lot of entertainment on Twitch. You guys are looking for somebody to watch, looking for some comp. They put up their players. A few players play on each of their streams. Multiple people, it's not just one person. So you get different gameplay, get jets sometimes, tanks, infantry. All up to you, just gotta click the follow button. Wow. 
I be willing to create 2N? No. Negative. Negative. Still waiting for a couple people here. Looks like we're ready to go. Like we're ready to rock and roll. Sometime when the countdown starts, we'll get right into it for Zavid. Alright, here we go, going into Zavid. DMI did win the first map, it looks like we have General in the tank again. He's gonna be by himself, I don't know what he's running, apparently it's glitched, probably running AP, autoloader. Um, he's running smoke actually, I don't think he has active protection on. Interesting choice, interesting choice. He's gonna go ahead and pick up an easy two-piece real early in the game. This is going to be a really heavy, heavy tank kill map. Looks like TR Pants is going to come in. He's going to start playing in here. Dark Riot going to go down on Bravo. It's not going to happen. Meanwhile, Havoc Slayer is going to go ahead and try and back cap here. He's going to maintain, try to drop some people off. Got a C4 Jeep coming in behind one end, one end's tanker. I don't think he sees him. Seabax Killer coming in with the C4. He's going to jump off and click the trigger, and there it goes, and Bonfin is going to go down. He gets flanked, and how done, nobody spotted, nobody helped him out. He's going to go down real easy. DMI is going to contest here. they got two people down. Black Knight, new player, he's jumping on in. He's going to contest here. He's got two in front. He's got an anchor. He's got a man in front. I don't know if he's going to pick him. He doesn't. Dark Knight's going to clean that up with his AK. Seabax Killer in general in the tank. Run thermal. He's got his gunner now. However, one end. This is a really strong one end map. They're really good on the ground. Really, really strong team on the ground. Extremely experienced on this map. At least when I was playing them, I used to play against them all the time. So it's they're they're a solid team. This could prove you know DMI is going to really have to do their best here because one end is known for really solid infantry. Real fathers up top. He's going to go ahead and choose not to destroy that. Ocean sensor apparently. Got a small out on General. Go down on top of him, got another one. General's down to 30% health probably about. See if he gets him. Go see him, a new player also for one in, jumping on in, Factor Z. In with here, he's got guys got underneath here. They're gonna try and go to Bravo. Probably a bunch of guys in front, although Ponte's up top right here in glitch spot. He's gonna go for an AK, he's gonna pick your real father off up top, he's gonna save his tank. The help out there, grenade out. It's got a man underneath. He's got to help out his buddy. He sees him, tells him call outs go down. He's got another two, two guys, three guys spawning in. Squad bomb is real. Beer's gonna go down, but not without Ponte's picking up one. Magna mustache is down. It's a trade. Demon is contesting. Does have a motion sensor up top. I'm surprised that one in did not destroy that when they were up there. However, gonna go with the trades. Dark right gonna get two. No, that was creatures. Sorry, creatures with one. Beer's gonna get the revive though. He's gonna lay down. He's got a man in front. Beer's going down. Ponte's pushing in. He's got a man. Two guys down underneath. Scruffy's gonna go ahead and clutch that. 
Jackpot. Also, one end's gonna hold on to that objective and take it. They're gonna get A, B. Now they're mo working on C here. Got a huge presence on C. They do have a three cap, early three cap on the DMI. DMI now losing their fourth objective here. Don't know what's gonna go on. We're gonna see. Jackpot moving in. Bonfin has just avoided some mines apparently on a quad bike. Black Knight for DMI is sitting in the back. They have two guys back capping here. Dark Knight, however, is back to contest. Has a man in front. He does get him as well. He got Havoc and he picks off Seabax. He's gonna jump in this Jeep. Knows that there's a guy here, two guys here now. They're contesting. Three guys, he's got a lot to deal with, and he's got a motion sensor. I don't know if it's gonna happen. Or he's sitting on mines. Might not survive this. He's gonna jump out, but he's gonna get he's gonna get destroyed by General Jones. Gonna go ahead and mop that up. Dark Knight is not gonna be able to hold that objective. He's gonna lose A, but that's alright. They do have B and C and they're working on D. Magna mustache underneath in tunnels. Working with his squad to make sure they have complete knowledge of everybody around. Demon gets picked on the objective. However, Magna Mustache is going to get shot from Heisenberg up top on the awning. Callout goes down, but he's going to get picked. Heisenberg with two people. He gets two picks. Ghost is going down. Uchi Great knows he's there. And an anchor. I don't know. Maybe he doesn't know he's there. Don't know. Got a motion sensor in front. Gonna play this a little bit passively. Pack of bunnies contesting on Delta. Has a tank in front. Don't know how much health it has, but he's going to go ahead and get a shot into Bonfin. But Bonfin's going to launch him into the air off the railroad tracks. Nice try, buddy. See you later. This is my objective. And that proves, you know, it's that hurts, man. I mean, he just completely blew his legs off, dude. I believe I can fly. And at least a backflip. Or a front flip. Maybe he's doing front flips. Demon's got a man in front. Dead man coming back. DMI coming back in a three cap. Maintaining their presence in this game. They're not gonna go down easily. As we have seen from the first two rounds, DMI does not go away easily. It doesn't matter if they're down by 150 tickets, they still keep fighting. One end's gonna have to maintain some, some control. Fector's gonna pick Demon, but if he's gonna get shot in his back, Heisenberg's just working mid right now, getting a few picks. Let me take a look at him. He's 10 and 6. He's got a man in front, Gucci Gray. He's got an AK running stubby muzzle. Classic stubby muzzle. That's from back with early, early game. Before any patches went out on it. All one ends up top. ACR went down from your real father. Picks off Heisenberg. He goes down. Trazer going in. Havoc and Seabax getting picks. Mirrored and Myriad and Real Father go down, but I think DMI is going to take this objective here. All the trades are real. The fight is going on down here at sea, but DMI is going to go ahead and easily hold this right now. They have a huge presence. I don't see them losing this anytime soon. Demon's up top. He's going for a two-piece. Gets picked. Your Real Father also going down the trades. No, oh, go CM picking off, picking off beer up top. Eisenberg's going down, but Dogman is left. He's going to get a revive on a teammate. They do have three people left here. One ends with the contest. They're going to try and burn off, but no squad bomb is coming in. They do have a motion sensor. Motion sensor gets spotted. There goes another call out from Dogman. Sees him in containers. Myriad creatures up top of the CZ. Four or five guys here for one end. He's parachuting down. Don't know if he wanted to, but he is down there. They are capping it back. Got a man behind him on stairs. Don't know if he sees him. Two guys in front, and a man behind. Creature's going for a flank right now. Got the CZ, misses his opportunity. They do have a beacon outside. Don't know if anybody knows it. CZ's just going to tear General apart. I think is devastating at close range. It's just you don't have a chance. Doesn't matter what gate. Doesn't matter what gun you use. Man behind. The call out goes out. Everybody's going to respond. They're going to cap C. You know one is there, two is there. CZ still. They're gonna hold on to see, but DMI is moving up. Garbage Jr. moving in with Dark Right. Trades are going down. One more left. Pack of bunnies trying to retreat into tunnels. He's gonna hold here. Contest. Still has one man in front. Take is now capping the objective. No, oh, he's gonna get shot from the tunnel behind him. Jackpot with a good play. Creatures again still working. That CZ almost got a two piece. We get Beer with a solid pick right there. Hop in with Bonfin real quick. He's got man in front with RPGs or Smaws. Knows he's there. All outs are going down. He's playing sort of a support role right now. He doesn't really need to push on the objective. He's just there. He's just maintaining a presence. Just wants people to hear him. He does have the Abrams. It's not like he's going to be able I don't know if he sees that C4 Jeep in front of him. C4 Jeep's coming. He does see it. He does see it. He has HMG, though. The C4 is real, and he's going to die. Oh, no. Unfin goes down. Seabax killer with a solid C4 Jeep. The Jihads. Trades. Vector's going to get picked. DMI making a heavy push for Bravo. Looks like they're gonna go ahead and take this TRV pants sitting back here, making sure nobody's back capping. 
always want to make sure you have one person back here. It's solid. There's an anchor. Pack of bunnies pushing up. He's using the ACR. Let's check out what he's using on just a stubby, stubby grip. It's been really, really well for worked really well for me in, in pubs at least. Just using a stubby on on guns, especially the Scar H, because you know I suck at infantry, so I need an overpowered weapon. DMI with a three cap. They're only down by 20 tickets. Mines are going down from pack of bunnies. Galvatron here pushing up. One ends on their back heels now. They're on their back heels. Gonna get picks though. Albatron with an AK. The tank now is supporting Roll Generals pushing up. Gonna go down with a shot, maybe. Oh no! Dogman gonna get Galvatron in the in the tanks. Creatures however though is gonna get this pickup. One end's gonna need to push up here. Got a man in front. Creature's gonna get picked. He gets called out. I don't know if you're gonna go for the revive. He does go for the revive. The late revive. Creatures might be able to get him back. No, he's gonna get shot in the back. Galvatron's going down. Pack of bunnies. Creatures with the turn. Oh nope. There goes Heisenberg with AK. Trades are going down in middle. Still one left. He's going to go ahead and get four people. Heisenberg is just tearing them apart right now, pushing on to Delta. He's going to try and contest. Got a man in front. Doesn't see him. He does see him. He's going to take him out too. Heisenberg making huge plays for DMI. Huge plays for DMI. Just ran straight through the heart of one end's infantry right there. That's tough, man. That is tough to swallow. Hey, however is being contested. Looks like DMI is going to wrap that up pretty easily. We're going to go ahead and hop right back in with Myriad. They're going to make a huge push while everybody's back at e at Delta. However, there is a Jeep pushing up. The tank's going to see him. Boom! He's going to get stopped, but I don't know if he has C4 or not. He does have C4, but Havoc's going to go down. He's going to get taken out. One end's going to push up here. They're going to need to get a multiple cap. They're gonna now losing by 20 tickets. The motion sensors are real. Got a man in front. Creatures gets picked by Garbage Jr. with an M16. A4 has got another man. Spray. He's going to go ahead and get picked. Garbage Jr.'s down. G18 in front. Beer's down now. Good plays by Scruffy. He's going to pick up Jackpot. Squad bomb coming in. Got man on Bravo. Now we're going to push for C. Got the motion sensor. Motion sensor is found. Two squads out on main objectives now, right here in the middle. This is this is clutch. If they can get both these objectives, the trade isn't in, in gonna go down. Demon's gonna get a two-piece easily. Now they're gonna contest. Demon's still alive underneath. Knows his motion sensor is gone. He's up on top now. I don't know if Galvatron sees it. He's just gonna go for the revives. Goes for a double revive. Creature's still alive. See if Scruffy can hop out. He's gonna try and get him. He does, he does. Another revive going down from Scruffy. Great plays, teamwork. He's gonna get picked by the tank, however. General pushing up. He's gonna clean up this all this nonsense going down on Charlie. He's going to go ahead and sit on there. Beer with a three-piece with his M16A4. However, Galvatron's working underneath. He's going to try and make a push for Bravo. He's got men behind. He's got a couple behind, a couple behind. I don't know if he sees him. He didn't see him in time. Jackpot going to be a Heisenberg with another two-piece. Heisenberg just tearing apart one end. No, Scruffy's going to get flanked. We got creatures going down. The, f the flanks are real. The push is real from DMI. They are scraping for these objectives. They want to maintain control. They do not want to lose middle right now. However, they did lose their back cap. Delta is being taken by DMI. I don't know if it's going to be enough. If one in holds here, if they're able, if they're able to take Charlie or Bravo, they could see themselves pulling back reasonably quick. They do have Delta still. They got rid of their back cap. Gucci's going to push up. Galvatron sitting up on top on pipes. Has a guy call out, go down. Gucci's going to get picked. Creature's going to go. No, Galvatron with the pick right there. However, Gucci will get picked up. Doesn't have to worry about it. Man up front. See if he can handle it. See what happens. See if Galvatron sees him. Knows him up top. Those are up top. DMI wreck him popping down. Going to pick off Galvatron. Maybe no. Galvatron with the AK is going to shut him down. However, DMI is moving in with three to four people. Haunts with the spray. Is It does work. He does get Galvatron. However, he's going to get picked. The trades are going down on Charlie right now. But at that time, there's still four people from one end on Charlie. Now they're making a play. I think they're trying to hold Bravo now. They are. They have five, six people here. One person contesting. It was Black Knight. He's gone. Going into tunnels now. They're going to push tunnels and topside. General's going to find himself completely surrounded here if he's not careful. He's going to take a lot of RPG fire. He's going to be hurting. He's got to get out of here. He's getting stopped by all the tanks. How are, oh, General with the shot on Dark Right. Dark Right goes down. Infantry help coming in for the General. He's calling it out. He's going to back out right here. Great play. He needs to get that tank out of there if he wants to keep it alive. 
One in with a three cap. They are only down by 30 tickets, 90 to 123. Beer pushing up again here with his squad. He's got a man in front. Real father is going to go down. He's going to get picked. Now over. Beer's going to go down as well. Mustache is behind him, but Mustache, I don't know if Mustache, he is going to live. Gucci great coming in with the save. The beacon pressure right here is proving pivotal for DMI. This beacon pressure, super easy flank right here. It's out on the side. They can get to whatever objective they want to. I don't know if 1A notices this beacon. They got motion sensors. The recon beacons are real. Beacon pressure is so hard to deal with, especially when you don't have time to go find the beacon. So you don't have extra people to go throw out on it. Monte's going up to the top. Man, they got double motion sensors going down now. Maybe that's just single. Demon up top. He's going to get picked. Gucci, great, great play. Still got the motion sensor. I don't know if pickups are allowed. I don't think they are. Ponce up top. Going to try and get a pick here. He does. He sees him. Waiting for him to climb up the ladder. Wait for an easy shot here. Boom. Great play. Way to wait. However, there is still a few more people parachuting in for DMI. They're just going to go ahead and squad bomb right now. Oh, they're going to go down. Vector Z and Scruffy getting two picks right there. Here comes one in. This response from one in on this objective. Pontes is going down as well. Bonfin with the back cap. There are two people. Is that Bonfin and I believe it's I don't know who else is here. Bonfin and somebody else. Oh. Bonfin's gonna get picked by Black Knight. We're gonna switch to Black Knight here. See what he sees, see what he's got. He's got a squad made in. He knows there's people here. Hide and seek is a tough game to play when you have no idea where anybody is. Especially in rubble like that, it's tough. Magna Mustache gonna make a play here. He's got his squad. We have a tie game right now, 79-79. The ticket, like this is real. The trades are going down. They're fighting for these middle objectives. One end making sure they have a huge presence here in the middle. They're gonna, they're, they got a big presence on Charlie. They might be able to hold it. Go CM sitting underneath for one end. Gets one pick, got one coming down. Gonna get double, no. Garbage is gonna go ahead and wrap that up. Ghost goes down, he's gonna get a revive. On Dogman underneath, they do still have a presence. One end does cap that objective. They have two objectives right now, 72 to 76, in favor of one end. That motion sensor still out. They might have found the beacon now. If they can get rid of that beacon, they're putting themselves in a huge position to win. TRV Pants sitting out in the bunkers. Uh, he's kind of come into Delta to try and cap that out of the base. One end with a huge, this is unreal. The amount of presence that's going down from one end in the middle. They need these objectives so bad they are fighting for it. Pack of bunnies gonna get one, but I think one end is gonna map mop this up real quick. And this contest isn't gonna work. It's not gonna work. However, the tank is on Charlie. That's a tough place for that tank to be. They are gonna get oh no, wait, hold on. TRV pants and Onfin are gonna be here on this objective. They have a man behind. There's proxy goes down. Recon is spotted. He's going in. The Reckham gets spotted. However, Dogman's going to get pants. And now the revive is going to come down. onfin has got to get him. He's not going to get him before the revive. He's got a two-on-one now without proxy. He's got to get a pick. He's not getting picks. He needs to get one of these right here. He's got to get one. He almost does. Close. The bunny hop saves his life. He does know there's a guy coming behind him. Reckham is going to get found out. The rat strats are not going to work. He has RPGs in front. 81. He's got another man coming back to help. They gotta have this back cap. If they can get this back cap, they're gonna be in great shape. Magnum Mustache, however, one end does have their hands full in the middle. They have a tank as well they have to deal with. It's almost dead. I don't think he got a hit marker. He didn't. That tank's still alive. General is still alive right now. Holding it down for his team. The ring around the Rosie. Looks like DMI lost ring around the Rosie. One end will maintain ring around the Rosie champions. On, uh, on Charlie. Ooh, head glitch. Nasty head glitch by the General out of RPGs. That's going to be, that's gone for them. Main, God, General's doing an amazing job of keeping his tank alive because that tank pressure, along with beacon pressure, is huge right now. Wreckham with a huge C4 on one end's tanker. There goes their armor support. We're going to see, probably going to see a lot of one end just coming here into the middle. There they are. They're all bailing out. They got two guys on the back cap. However, DMI is up by 13 tickets, and they do have three objectives capped compared to none for one end. One in is contesting. I don't think they're going to get Charlie. They're not. There's a man behind. Talk to Bunnies. Doesn't see him. Gucci's going to go ahead and get that. No, Jackpot's going to get that. One in might pick this up. They do need two objectives, though. They have a tank pulling in. And they get Bravo as well. I don't know if they're going to be able to get it. DMI Garbage Jr. DMI trying to get picks here. Go see him. Still alive for one in on the objective. Myriad gets picked. Scruffy pushing into Charlie. Still have a motion sensor. They still have a motion sensor on Charlie. It's going to prove pivotal. They're going to know they're coming. Got to get rid of that. He's going to go ahead and find it. Havoc Slayer with, uh, forgot who's in the tank already. General. 
they're gonna have squad. Oh, there's three guys in front. Havoc's gonna get one with the ACR, but he's I think he's gonna get picked. No, his teammate Black Knight's gonna be there to pick off pants. Two more in rubble. Black Knight moving up with the CZ, and that's gonna be a wipe. That is a wipe, complete wipe. If I'm not mistaken, that is a complete wipe. For one in on the back cap. That is, they're gonna maintain that objective. Losing tickets now. They're losing a lot of tickets. I don't know if they're gonna be able to pull within. I don't think it's gonna happen. Three objectives to none. It's not gonna happen. And DMI is gonna hold on to win this one. 35 tickets to zero. DMI, what an amazing game by General. I'm just gonna do a shout out to him. Amazing tank gameplay. He kept his tank alive, kept the pressure up. That beacon pressure was huge for DMI. One end fighting and doing what they do best on infantry. And for right there in that middle part of that game to easily bring it right back. They bring it right back within tickets. It's absolutely amazing trades going down. Great gameplay, teamwork, callouts. I mean, just the whole nine yards. This is what you want to see between two teams. We have not had a game that was completely out of hand, and that's what that's what we like to see. Two very evenly matched teams. Um, and, you know, it's just proving pedal. The little things like the motion sensors are huge right now for DMI. Literally, that is that is huge for them. That might be the turning point. Is the motion sensors and that beacon pressure are the turning point? In my opinion, I think that's the turning point in this game. If one in maybe throws a beacon down and gets beacon pressure on the back side of the objectives, maybe maybe they do that. Maybe they get their own beacons in, so we have this little bit of a beacon war going on. You might have seen a, a little bit of a different game. I don't know. It could, it could be up in the air, but DMI was the only one using beacons and motion sensors. I think that was the pivotal turning point. For that game, like one end was in control for a good part of that game in the middle, but that beacon pressure kept putting guys on that objective extremely fast. That tank, that general's tanking, staying alive when he's down to 30% health did help that, you know, he made a, a good move there at the very end of the game and missed a, an RPG by Magnum. Magnum went out with an RPG, had one chance to get him before he got picked. Magnum stayed alive, took the chance, just happened to miss the RPG. It's unfortunate, you know, you just... Stuff like that happens. There's nothing you can do about it. <sighs> Excuse me while I get a little bit of water. Voice box is getting a little bit dry. I'm going to throw up another poll for you guys here. What do you think is going to win this last round? What is the ticket count? That is that. Maybe that's what I should do. Maybe I should do ticket count. What do you think? I don't, I don't, I'm not sure. I don't know, man. Let's see what happens. I'm going to make a poll. You guys go ahead and check it out. Hmm. Tough game, man. These guys are really, really putting it up. Shout out to everybody playing in this game right now. They're doing an amazing job. Absolutely amazing job. Great gameplay coming from both sides. Just pivotal moments. Missing opportunities is, is really what's causing some problems, you know? It just happens. It's just conquest, though. You don't maintain control of objectives. You're going to start losing tickets. All right, guys. I'm going to put up a poll. It's going to be a pretty simple one. The poll is live. The poll is live. Go ahead and vote. Get your votes in now. Looks like DMI is just going to go straight for a back cap right now. They're going to drop three or four guys off on top of one end's tanker. Bonfin's got to be able to destroy this. Handle this. Here we go. Got C4 going down from multiple people. He's going to get hit right there. Here it comes. One more. And there goes the tank. He's the, the immediate rush by DMI with the C4. The recon. <laughs> the recon rats are real. So many. Here comes a Jihad Jeep. They're making sure that they're taking Bonfin out of the game. And there's nothing you can do as a tanker. When you get focused down by five or six people, there is literally almost nothing you can do. General's just going to be uncontested, pretty much. He's got to deal with medics on the middle objectives right now. He sees him with thermal. He's going to shoot him straight through at his feet. Jackpot's ankles are going to get busted. However, Jihad's coming in. General doesn't see it. Great return fire by Dark Right. Good job for his team. However, DMI has a huge presence on this objective. On Charlie, there's a lot of people. They're going to easily take this flag. But Magnum is on the back cap. They're going to try and get their, oh, on their home cap. They're going to try and get it. He's got two people in front. Runs up and just gets slaughtered. Slaughtered. Unfortunate. 
Dark Knight moving in underneath. He's going to contest Bravo. He's got a squad with him. There is a beacon, however. He's got a man in front. He's going to go with the Euro step right there. Got another man underneath. He's got the AK. He's got two now. Two. He's going to get for one. He's got one. He got two. He got another two piece. There's still one more though. However, they're not going to get it. And it looks like DMI is going to maintain control. Vector here is the motion balls, the pokey balls. He's not trying to get caught right now. However, his teammate's going to spawn in. Pants doesn't hear it. And here comes the C4. Oh, gets close. Two guys right there in front of him. General, he's moving it around. He's got a man flanking. He's got two or three in front. I don't know if he's going to be able to get it. The LTRT is not going to work. Havoc Slayer is going to pick him up with the ACR. Dark Knight's going down on this back home objective. Bonfin, the last person here. Knows there's a guy behind the wall. Sees him. Oh, but he's almost getting picked through the window. Pack of bunnies moving in now. They have targeted him. They do have a motion sensor. There's two now. It's a two on two. Looking right now. Pack of bunnies is seeing him. He's just looking for other people right now. Not going to see it. Galvatron coming in. He's going to get picked by Demon. Demon with the heads up play right there. One in looking, looking like they're going to struggle here a little bit early. But they're going to just look for a rally. They will rally. They will get a couple objectives here. They just got to get their feet under him. C4 is going down from Rackham. They're just sitting up there with motion sensors and beacons. The beacon pressure, like I was saying, only two guys contesting. Jay legit. Ghost is going to get one, but he's going to go down as well. Guys underneath for one end. Trying to block the stairwells with the Jeeps now. Black Knight's going to go ahead and get him with an M4 Magnum mustache. And he's going to get your real father. Gets a two-piece right there. That was a clutch two-piece to shut down one end from that spawn underneath. Gucci Great coming in here. He's got his M16 or an M4. He's going to get one, but he's going to get picked by Holy Dogman. Dogman's going down by Ghost. The trades are real. Ghost, can he get it? No, he can't. Here comes Magnum Mustache, though, to get Heisenberg. He's going to pick up Real Father. Their revives are going down. They're going to make sure they have presence here. They do. They get it. They clutch it. Although that beacon pressure up on top again. Still got that beacon. It's going to pop right back in and cap back him. Back cap him real quick behind him. I don't know if they know it's there. They're going to have to try and get rid of those beacons at one point gonna prove really difficult here we go here comes the beacon pressure motion sensor on alpha vector z again having to deal with all this detection he's gonna get picked both dmi guys popping out and destroying vector havoc slayer by himself here gonna try and contest this has a guy coming up knows the guy's coming up motion sensor balls crouch is real tank is gonna have picks off bonfin great placement right there Great placement. However, DMI is off to an early start here. Almost up to a 100 ticket lead. Looks like we'll go ahead and remove the polling from here. Black Knight, DMI, there it is. Has one in front. Ghost with the two piece right now. I don't know if he's going to get picked. Can he get three? Watching the kill feed. He does. He gets three on Bravo. Great hold. General pushing into the middle objectives here. He's not worried because he has motion sensors everywhere. Montes, again, man in front, but he's going to get picked. Magnum Mustache working it. He's got a two-piece, easy two-piece. Fucking beer, he's going to get him. Excuse my language, but I'm just reading his name. He's going to go ahead and get him, and they're going to start taking Bravo here. One man trying to contest. Bonfid still having trouble with his home objective. This is so annoying as a tanker when you literally can't get out of your base because there are people. Guy went to his left. He didn't see him. Apparently, he didn't see him. He's got another one right there. He's going to try and just get rid of these buildings, hopefully. Almost got a hit marker. He's, got, he's working on him. It's a tough one. He's got two or three recons to deal with on that objective. Meanwhile, in the middle, one in is struggling right now to get a presence in the middle, but they do have a back cap. General's moving back to Tropoli. Try and get rid of it. Sees a man in front. Wreck him. Looks like he's using a Ace 21, if I'm not. It's Ace 21 CQB. They're going to push on a Delta to get their home flag. Hopefully, they can looking for they got four or five guys they're probably going to get that pretty easily ghost meanwhile is going to try and jump in this transport chopper and maybe drop some people off magnum mustache contesting he's got a man on the ground he does he gets him revives going down got a man another man coming around the train gets him as well magnum mustache making huge plays right now for his team revives going down for fector one end's going to hold on to it they need that objective they do need another one though Holy Dogman is losing his, losing the back cap, but it's only in the gate. Oh no, the C4 trap is going to go down. He's going to get him. Havoc Slayer with an amazing C4 trap putting behind Bonfin. There's no way Bonfin could have seen that coming. It was great play by Havoc. Absolutely great play. Holy Dogman here to contest, but he's going to get picked off by Jackpot. Jackpot's going to 
go ahead and take care of something going on there. I don't know. I think we missed something. Maybe a little bit of feelings going on. The G18s. Galvatron, DM. Sorry, excuse me. One in up top. Galvatron has a man in front. Guy spawned on him. Doesn't see the guy behind. He's gonna go for the spin. Doesn't work. 360 doesn't happen. He only gets one. See if Jay legit. He's gonna jump down here. He's gonna get picked jumping down. Oh no. Probably should have just shot him from up top, but. Oh, that's unfortunate. Mr. Lemming now popping in for one in. Got C4 going down. The bunny hop is real. Jackpot, however, is going to take him. Garbage. Oh, Havoc Slayer with his ACR is going to take him out. Trades are going down. Watch out. Pushing this here. Mr. Lemming is going to get picked by a pack of bunnies. DMI wreck him here on A as well, helping his teammate out. They're going to maintain that back cap, however, in the meantime, 1N has capped three objectives. They are losing their own back cap, though. A heavy presence from DMI to make sure they get this back. 1N is here. Two, two infantry with tank support here. General is in no bad shape or form at all. Black Knight trying to get an M4 pick. Is he going to get it? No, he's not. And going to get away. Garbage Jr., they're all pushing in now. Into C, into Bravo. We're going to try and get this man in front. Oh no, Ghost is getting picked. He's the only man to stop four people. Didn't work out. Revive's going down. They're going to maintain control of that. Hans is going to be here, working his AEK. The only man here, one man army, contesting his objective. However, DMI knows he's there. General's going to get him picked. An AP shell. Too bad for Pants. Body has been blown to shreds. DMI looking extremely strong in middle objectives. Three objectives now, three out of four. We're working on that back cap. Huge squad push right now. The whole team is pushing to secure the win. They're trying to. They're just gonna try and just do it right here. But extreme amount of pressure onto one in. One's gotta clutch this, hopefully get a back cap. They got a Jeep going around the outside. Bonfin's got men in front, and he's got a tank. He's gotta have a tank battle as well as deal with all this infantry. The infantry presence from DMI, they got two people ever. RPGs, he just missed an RPG. Black Knight missed a wide open RPG, that's all right. He might get another one, he just got one into him. Bonfin in a serious amount of trouble. He's gonna get hit here. No, he's not, he got lucky. Huge presence from DMI on the back cap for one in on the home flag. However, he's got help coming in from Pants. Pants gonna get picked, but it's not gonna be enough. One person is not gonna be enough. Magnum's moving in. He has a man in front, throwing down a med pack. He gets him. He's alive. Got help. 44 to 206. Gonna need a few objectives, and they're getting a few objectives right now. Bravo and Charlie going down there. Still not out of this game at all. They're not out. They can hold it. They can hold it. EMI hit a huge push right there, but they can afford it at this point with 200 tickets left in the game. And they're still on the back cap. Still on the home cap, excuse me. Still on the home cap. General's gonna move around here. Jay legit behind him. Oh no, it's Seabax killer. He sees him. Seabax sees him. He must have proxy. He's gonna try and get a little bit of an angle. He's gonna get shot in the back though. And he's a teammate. Teammate's gonna get spawned. Galvatron unfortunately on the spawn right there. General's pushing him with an ACR. He's coming in behind him. Let's see what happens. He got low health though. Nothing. Bonfin maintaining control of this objective. Has a gunner. There's a guy. Has a guy to the left right there. Gonna get mobility hit. No. Jumping out. Not jumping out. Bonfin and Pants working it on that objective, having a little bit of trouble. UG and his squad are going to hold down that objective on oh, Bravo. They're going to hold that down. Beacon pressure coming in from DMI on the backside of Charlie. Dark right is only a medic. What can he do? What can he do? He's got infantry in front. He's going to get one, possibly get a revive here. He's got to get a revive. He does. He's got a tank behind him, though. Another man goes down. Only so many revives. Doesn't work. He gets glitched. He has a man in front. Oh, with the hero step. Again, Dark right with the hero step. Shutting down. Oh, pulls out the Swagnum. Swagnum's gonna go ahead and connect. Seabax killer going down. Day legit with a one piece. He's got one with an ACR. Real father gets killed by the Abrams. Trades are real right now. He's gotta keep people alive. They gotta keep these tickets up. He's doing an amazing job of it. He's just trying to get a 20. Not gonna work because Dice doesn't tell him where the actual body is. And transport chopper coming in. Dark right with the spot. Havoc Slayer flying it gonna go ahead and try and drop some people off. Seabax killer under a lot of stress right now with 28 health. Gonna get repairs. He's 
gonna go ahead and survive. Your real father throwing down mines. Hopefully he can get a kill here. RPGs and smalls going in, but those reps are gonna easily rep those out. 27 to 169, two objectives to two. Trades are gonna have to go down. Revives are gonna have to be real. I don't know if you're gonna have to waste your time on that. You gotta get out. Real father gonna pull it out. No, he's not. He's gonna get killed. He gets picked. Vector Z pushing up on Charlie. Got a man in front. He's gonna get knocked down by Garbage Jr. Garbage gonna maintain that objective. Pants making a huge move right here. Going up top. Knows the guy's up top. He doesn't get him though. Havoc Slayer with the clutch. He legit by himself here. He's got a man. Fellow squad mate. Trades are going down. He's getting caught. Jackpot by himself now. He's gotta get a revive. He's gonna push for it. 20, gonna do a quick 20 to maintain, maybe, no, he's not gonna get that pick. Waiting for a guy to pop out, no, he's gonna get, Fuente is gonna get wrecked, wrecked him. Pops right back out, trades are going down on Bravo, it's real. Four objectives to zero though, this is gonna be it, that is it, ladies and gentlemen. DMI is gonna walk away, with 162 ticket win there, amazing plays by DMI. Gotta hand it to them, they came ready. They came ready to play. Had extreme. Extremely good map control, squad movement, the, the beacon pressure, the teamwork with the tank backing out and holding on, you know, it's, that's tough, man. You got to give it to them. They played extremely well. One in, did whatever they could. They were trying to hold on. It just wasn't enough. Maybe next time. That, was the, that is the finals, though, and DMI is your winner. Great games to everybody who played. Solid. Amazing. I'm extremely